Hey guys, welcome back to another video. It's your man, Jay Will. So I want to go over some of the features that I noticed immediately when using iOS 9 on my iPad. Uh, they're not new. You probably surfed to scour the internet and found a bunch of them out there already. But uh, the first thing is the new multitasking. Uh, this is how it looks. I think it looks a lot better. It works great. Um, I think that's nice. You can actually go back around to your homepage there. Um, the slide in feature is pretty nice. So if I open up the web browser, I normally have mine set up now. You don't see it yet, but when I slide over, you'll see my Twitter. This is how I have it set up currently, like so. And then I'll lock it in place like this. Now you can actually make this take up how much of the screen you want, but I keep it about right there. I think that's enough for me to entertain myself with the web browser and Twitter. Now you can put other things here. You can just go ahead and uh, hold up here and you drag down, and then I can go to my news feed, videos, or whatever, tips. Um, I don't know exactly how many different applications you can put in here, uh, but you can have those, as you can see. Those are the ones that it's limited to for now, from what I can tell. Uh, but I normally just keep my um, Twitter in here, and I think this is very nice. Finally, my iPad seems like it's getting some good use. Now, another great feature that they've added in here, uh, maybe I can double tap here and get to it from the... Uh-oh. Uh you can play a video, and then when you hit the home button, it'll go down to this small window here, and you can kind of have a feel of, uh, you can watch a video if you want to, surf the internet, and get on Twitter. Finally, this is some sort of multitasking from Apple, which I can extremely appreciate. Um, this is really good. So those are some of the key features that I think I, I like the best about it. Um, you can close this out or you can make it bigger or pause. You can only move that video to the four corners from what I understand and what I've tried. Uh, now one other thing, uh, the multitasking again is pretty sweet. I like that. Um, what, what else did I wanted to show you? I wanted to show you the now search is all the way over here and your recent apps is here. The people you talk to, um, you can do all these different nearbys and your, my news feed is there. You can still search by swiping down like so and you now have these recent apps right here. Uh, but that's pretty much it. So every time I open my web browser, as long as I have the split screen turned on and my Twitter feed will always open. And I think this is probably the way my iPad will probably stay because I'm, I'm always tweeting and doing things. And you can see the last tweet there three minutes ago is about iOS 9 iOS 9 is obviously the biggest update, I think, and they're going to get better over time. Um, I don't know if there's going to be an iOS 9.1, 2, 3, or 4, uh, but there definitely should be an iOS 10 by next year, and I think it's going to be good. Also, iCloud is out now to where you can have the new storage options. Um, let's get into settings here and go to iCloud, and you can see storage options. Uh, you can now see the new storage plans are available. As you can see, I have the 50 gigs for uh, 99 cents a month. I think that's a great option for, for Apple people. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. In the settings, you now have a battery section uh, where you can see this uh, separated on its own. Uh, other than that, I can't really think of that. I saw too many things that were different. Uh, but that's it, man. I think that uh, Apple did a great job with the the ios uh, 9 update i'm pretty excited about it so have you updated your um, phone or tablet yet uh, i'm gonna probably leave one of my iphones on the older ios so i can compare it to the the um ios 9 on, on my iphone 6s plus but we shall see i mean this probably won't be much difference uh, just a few tweaks here and there it look a little different but nonetheless uh definitely the ipad if you have an ipad you should definitely update your ipad to iOS 9. I think you'll really be pleased with the new split view, the video, um, the new multitasking, I think is pretty nice. And you swipe these away just like you would anything else. You just swipe them away like so. Really nice. I'm really digging the side panel here. I really like that. So it's your man Jay Will. I will see you guys in the next video. This is uh, my update on my iOS 9 on my iPad. Hope you guys update yours and have a good day. Take care.